little problem, this Rubik's Cube. Now I'm sure a lot of you at home have a Rubik's Cube and probably took the stickers off and replaced them exactly what I did. That is called cheating. Now there's guys out there that can take Rubik's Cubes, throw them up in the air, and completely solve them. I can't do that. I wish I had that talent to do it. However, I came up with my own way of cheating. Um, so the idea, this Rubik's Cube, no matter how many times I'm going to twist and turn this Rubik's Cube, I will not be able to solve this Rubik's Cube at all. So I want to show you exactly how this is going to work. Now, Rubik's Cube, there's so many different algorithms in the Rubik's Cube to solve these things, and I'm just trying to see if I can find the proper one right there. So no matter how many times I twist and I turn, I still cannot solve the Rubik's Cube. It completely still gets messed up, except for when I throw it up in the air just like that, and the Rubik's Cube solves in a matter of seconds. Now, I did tell you I was going to cheat, so when I throw the Rubik's Cube up in the air the first time, your eyes watched. That is called misdirection. So when I threw it up this way, you watch the Rubik's Cube. But that's when I switched. See, the hand is actually quicker than the eye. I actually switched Rubik's Cubes as it was going up in the air. So I told you the first time I'm going to cheat. Now, I'm going to cheat again for the second time, now that you're prepared. So I'm going to take this Rubik's Cube and this one here, and they're both going to switch. But I'll take this one here and place it behind my back, and it's going to switch with this one here. So remember, this one and this one are going to switch places. Watch carefully, because I am going to cheat for the second time. So here we go. See the switch? I thought not. So since it's Christmas Daddy's, I'm going to do it for the third time. I'm going to cheat for the third time. One Rubik's Cube is going to go up in the air, and the other one is going to change, and it's going to be completely solved. Just like two Rubik's Cubes solved. Just like solving the community.